President Joe Biden and First Lady Jill Biden made a stop at Cherry Point today. It's all part of the First Lady's Joining Forces initiative. Now on your side, Cheyenne Pagan has more about the special event they had with service members. The President and First Lady served up food to local troops for a Friendsgiving they'll never forget. Hearing from the Bidens in person meant a lot to the troops in attendance. It touches us more than anything, and especially for our family and friends that aren't here with us today, especially the ones overseas deployed as well. The President and First Lady let the troops and their families know just how grateful they are for them. No one in the world misunderstands that you are the finest fighting force in the world. That is not a joke. That's the God's truth. So thank you, thank you, thank you. The Bidens also served up some food for the families that came through. Then they spent time going around to the different tables and meeting each of the service members and their families. My Joining Forces White House initiative is still ongoing to support military families. Governor Cooper and his wife also served up some food to show their support. Overall, the night was full of holiday cheer for the service members that sacrificed so much for the country. Even though you're away from your families at home in your home states, we know that you're here with your family here because military is family. It's very helpful and makes us feel better that we are seen and heard down at the lowest level within the military. This isn't the Biden's first time stopping in North Carolina just last year. They actually served up food to troops on Fort Bragg too. On board Cherry Point, Cheyenne Pig and Nine on your side. And today was all about service members and their families. They are the sacrifices both made throughout the course of service to our country. Now on your sides, Claire Curry brings us more from what this meal means to them. Having the governor and president on base was a great treat for many, but spending it with friends and family made the night. At the ceremony, the Gonzalez family had the privilege of introducing the Bidens to Marine Corps Air Station Cherry Point, as well as give a speech about what this supper means to them. Jennifer Gonzalez says that this time spent breaking bread is to remember the hard times, the good times, and honoring everyone who has served, something the Biden family understands. Gonzalez says that spending the evening with the president alongside her family means the world to her. We don't always get that chance to kind of sit down and just eat together and make memories together. So the times that we do, it's nice to be able to share those. She adds that the friends they've made through their time serving the country is an unbreakable bond she will always cherish. Many say they're still celebrating Thanksgiving, but this was a perfect way to start off the holidays. In Havelock, Claire Curry, 9 on your side.